My name is Corporal Travis Williams. I was uh, serving with Lima Company, 3rd Battalion, 25th Marines, 4th Marine Division, and I am 22 years old. Some of these people have a lost generation. They're, they're gone, either psychologically or physically. They're, they're never going to be the same again. And I never forget that guy because he had the same wooden band the guy had. I never forget that guy's name. And after that, I never, I never forgot anybody's name that died. There could be trouble coming. Multiple casualties inbound, and uh, I thought that they were both alive. So I'm like, oh, okay, this guy needs help right away. So I pulled it out, and uh, he, his head was missing. He just had half. You know, just, I've never seen anyone without their head. I think it was five soldiers that died, and we just couldn't do nothing about them. They were guys that had opinions just like me or you. Maybe some supported it, maybe they didn't. There's just no way of saving them. Everything went black. AKs for Sam 16s, repeating history. Some call us Vietnam, but would they take a stand? And this is last of us. I give them all my trust, did everything I could. For what purpose? Even if you were supported the war, all had a different reason for being there. You're coming up with this ambiguous reason for war. There was nothing you could do. You know, all the fiction in the world isn't going to change the fact that you're stuck in Iraq for the next seven months. Iraqi civilization supported the Egyptians. It was frustrating to just exist in that scenario, in that environment. I mean, a rational person would have been upset at the people that sent you there. Where are you going? Later, they started with the IEDs. Um, they started stacking landmines. Every time you got them, they did something. It was like they became that, like, no winning. When someone's shooting at you, you shoot at them.